Hey guys, welcome back from in Homestead. A little video here on the how to, or how I make anyway, the perfect pork crackling. In here we've had a, got a piece of pork shoulder that's been about two and a half hours. So, it's out now. I'm going to crank this oven up pretty much maximum. So let's just bring this camera back. Just stuck there a little bit. So first thing I've got to do is just take these uh, elastic uh, string bits off. Now I need uh, something to lift that up with, just bear with me again one second. One side. So the next thing I'm going to do is just Drain all that stock off into a bowl. And I'm just going to scrape those bits out of the pan. Now so what you want to do is get the joint back in the pan now at the moment there's a little bit there that started to crackle but here it's quite soft so what you want to do is get this get a knife and just uh, Tell you what, I'll get some pair of these, see if it will work, and just peel that skin off. And we're trying to get as uh, little fat on it as we can in so doing. Okay, so something like, if you can see that, something like that. So what I'm gonna do now, take that back out, plant that in there. There's some more stock come out, so I'll drain that off. So what you do, get the skin, put it fat side down, that's how I do it. I'll have to remove that before I left it. Now, I'm just going to whack that back in the oven. So that's how it looks now. So I'm going to whack that back in the oven for about 10 minutes. The oven's at, at its hottest. So I'll bring you back in about 10 minutes, okay, and we'll have a look at it then. So it's been in around about eight minutes or so. Let's have a look. You 
see all the fat that's coming out. So what we're going to do is just drain that off. Okay, I've got a little tub there. Just use it to unstick the skin. And I'm going to turn it over. So I'll drain that fat off. Turn it over. And can it starting to crisp up now? So back in. We'll have another look at it in say uh, oh, let's give it about another five minutes. Alright. Okay, it's been in about another four minutes I guess and I've I drained it, the fat off within that time. Let's bring it over a minute. You can see it. Okay so again there's a little bit of fat there, I'm going to drain that off. Okay, then now what I'm going to do is take that, just place it on this bit of foil, and just to give you an idea at the moment. Okay, so what I'm going to do is place it on this foil, and we'll just let that cool. I'm going to turn the oven off now, and we'll let that cool for about maybe three minutes or something, and then I'll bring you back and we'll have a look at it then. Okay, so it's been two or three minutes. <clears throat> Look at that. I'll pop it in this bowl over here. There's the bit with the foil on. Salvage some of that. Just that little bit there that's still a bit chewy. So there you go. Let's try that piece. <laughs> Good knew that. Like a blinking arse crunch in a carrot or something. Oh, perfect. That's how I make um, perfect pork scratching pretty much every time. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.